into a fight for the world number one position between Tim O'Connell and Tillman Hooper. Tim O'Connell, he makes a statement here on Championship Sunday. And as the numbers are coming together, he has got one Cheyenne Championship already. He's looking for number two. Numbers are in. 89 points! With Bearback riding champ Tim O'Connell. Tim, you add another impressive win to your already impressive season that you've had so far. Take us through, uh, you know, what worked for you out there today. You know, I take it this whole week. I drew Sankey horses every time. <laughs> and I drew, drew it as top end every time. You know, I was very blessed to get great draws this entire week. I got to get on Sozo in the first round. I won a round at Pendleton on him. Won my preliminary round here. Second in the semifinals, I had Prairie Rose. We've won multiple NFR rounds on that horse. Watched my traveling partner win Rapid City. Finally get to test my salt against that. She took me straight to the pin pay window that day with a tie for the top. And, uh, you know, she, she gathered most of my points I felt that day. She made me ride the fine line of out of control and in control that day. And then uh, today to have Irish eyes. I was supposed to get on that horse last Sunday, and I was beat up, sore, and hurt. My wife actually convinced me to go home and, and take some time and she said go get ready for the dad and take four days off at home and kind of recharge and you know god bless me to, to get that draw here today um and i knew like when as soon as she turned back and i've seen her do that trip many times that she's gonna blow up and she's gonna kick and she's gonna snap and she's gonna give me the opportunity to show my stuff and she did everything in her part and more today and it allowed me to showcase my best ride of the day off and here we are as a champion i, mean, I, just, I just can't thank the sankey pro rodeo uh Stock contractors for blessing me with three great animals to get the job done this week, and uh, you know I'm just I'm glad my wife told me to go home last week. <laughs> Sometimes you got to listen to him, Tim. You know you get the win here at the Cheyenne Frontier Days Rodeo. Where does this rank in your uh, you know your career wins? You have Calgary just a couple of weeks ago. You get that one now here in Cheyenne. It's the dad. You know people that don't know rodeo know that no Cheyenne Frontier Days. No, this is the daddy of them all. You know as a little kid you dream just to compete here. So to, to come here and have two two victories under my belt, have two Cheyenne Frontier Day saddles sitting in my trophy room. You know, it ranks up there with some of the biggest accomplishments in my career, and I mean that from the bottom of my heart. You know, like, there's not a place in this earth, hardly, that on a Sunday afternoon when it comes to Showdown Rodeo Sunday, we got a packed house at the Cheyenne Frontier Days, and it doesn't matter, rain, shine, tornadoes, we're coming, we're bringing it. <laughs> Even tornadoes, huh? You're, you're ready to ride through that? Well, I've seen it here before, so, I mean, they will. Absolutely, Tim. And then with this win, you know, last year you finished second, you know, right back in, into the hunt to, to get another championship underneath your name. You know, what's it going to take over the next few months to set yourself up for December here in Las Vegas? It's going to take everything from the bottom of your guts and more. You know, this is just a great stepping stone in the right direction. Um, I've learned in my career, especially after last year, you know, I had to dig deep and soul search after that. You know, that was a tough loss for me. You know, that was just one small rodeo. You can go back to five rodeos that I turned out last year that could have meant the difference in a gold buckle. It took me a long time to get over that. And, uh, you know, Casey won it. Casey won it fair and square last year, and you don't take anything away from him in that. But it was hard for me to lose that championship. But I've, I've learned from this experience, and in the darkest times, you got to look for the light. And the light for me was to enjoy these moments, enjoy these big wins, enjoy these small wins, and enjoy these your everyday life in rodeo because we, we, we have a time period that we can't do this forever. And, you know, to be here at the Cheyenne Frontier Days, and to win it for a second time and have my wife and my son here with me, there's not a specialer moment in the world to me than that. Well, enjoy this one, Tim. It was a big one for you. Congratulations. Thank you very much. There it is. Tim O'Connor, your Shine Tier for Tier Days champion.